What's going on people? We are Tottenham TV here. Back with another predicted lineup video. We have got Watford at home in the Premier League this weekend. After a international break that was, you know, kind of welcome to be honest. Probably the first international break I've ever looked forward to. Um, and I probably could have gone on for longer and I wouldn't have minded. But look, Tottenham are playing this weekend against Watford who are bottom of the league. And if we can't get a result this weekend, like really God help us. Uh, bringing in the team news. The only absentees this weekend are Hugo Lloris, obviously we know he had that horrific injury at Brighton, and Christian Eriksen who's having a late fitness test who I don't think will feature. You've got Giovanni Lo Celso and Ryan Sessegnon who are both back in full training, back in full fitness, but I still think this game will come a bit too soon for them. But the formation we're going for is a 4-2-3-1 formation. Um, I just don't want to see this diamond anymore, just give it up Poch. I think in goal is obviously going to be Gazaniga. Right back's an interesting one, so we've got a choice between Aurier, Carl Walker Peters, and Juan Foyf. Uh, Aurier, I think no words need to be said there. We know what his last two performances held up. Um, Carl Walker Peters hasn't really held up that match tree since starting for Spurs, so I'm going for Juan Foyf. He started two games for Argentina there in the past week so I'm going for Juan Foyf to start at right back and to make that place his own he really needs to left back it's a toss up between Danny Rose and Ben Davis we saw Danny Rose put in an absolutely shocking display for England and but I'm sticking with Danny Rose I think he's going to start centre backs is going to be Toby and Yan I think them two to start the game uh, in the double pivot I'm going for Undombele and Harry Winks um, and then with the three behind the striker I think we've got to go with two wingers play with Son and Lucas on either flanks with Eric Lamella in the centre role just behind Harry Kane. So that is the lineup I'm going for. Let me just repeat it. It's Gazaniga in goal, uh, Juan Foyf at right back, Danny Rose at left back, Jan and Toby in the middle, uh, midfield two of Harry Winks and Tongi Undombele um, with Lucas, Son and Eric Lamella just behind Harry Kane. So there you have it. I think that's a team more than good enough to win this game and when you look at the bench as well, if this lineup is, you've got Deli Ali on the bench, you'll have Ben Davis, Serge Aurier, Musa Soko, Oli Skip and with obviously Michel Vaughan coming back, um, back in. So if this is the lineup and we can play to our full capabilities, I trust us to swipe this Watford team away. But look, we've seen it in the past that we haven't been playing to our full capabilities. Players are taking liberties. I think we can win this game, but will it kickstart our season? It remains to be seen. I need to see consistent performances and seeing after this game, we've got Everton and Liverpool away double header. It's going to be difficult, but look, I'm backing us to win this game 1-0. I think it's going to be tight. I think it's going to be nervy, but I think we can just get over the line. Um, yeah, so I'm going for 1-0. Let me know in the comment section below what you think the scoreline is going to be. Like, subscribe and comment. And as always, come on, you Spurs. Yeah!